Greetings and salutations, friends, and welcome back. So, I deleted my little castle-y thing. And had a little play with a couple of ideas. Uh, well, one of the biggest issues I'm coming across is... is um, getting buildings to line up with the path. And then getting your archways to line up with the path too. Or your entrances or your doors or whatever. Um... It's, it's actually a real problem. If you put down a path width of, of 8, uh, let's see here, 8 is a double width path, so we put down a path width of 8. Alright. Now, when we slap down a shop, now the problem... <laughs> Okie dokie, now. Oh, my path isn't long enough. Alright, now it should be. So, you want to slap down a shop. Alright, not a big deal. Okay, so, now we have the auto-align. Or the, the auto-connect. That's great, that's great. Um, but I want to get it as close to the path as I can. So, if I put it there... Okay, so that's our first building down. Now, what if I want to put one on the other side? It's too close, it won't join. Right? So I have to offset it about that far. Which I don't like the look of. It looks kind of crap. Because it's not symmetrical with the other side, right? Yeah. Okay. So what if we offset both sides? Lastly. Alright, so now. Alright, so. You know, I'll offset both sides. I'll put this one slightly offset. And then I'll put this one slightly offset. Alright! See, that looks great! Okay, now, but we have a new issue. Uh, if we try and continue on with this one particular building, uh, our archway isn't going to fit on the path. It's either going to be there, leaving that big green space there. I didn't line these up properly with the edge of the pathway, excuse me. It's either going to have that big gap there, or it's going to be in the middle of the path. Which, you know, it's not great. Alright, so the option is, build it as its own entity. I'd have to move the whole thing over slightly. So that gives us an option to build around these things with, you know, with, with these extra parts. But then we run into another issue. What happens when we want to do that? Or, you know, we turn a wall sideways. It, it you know, it... it uh. So I think what I'm going to do... You know what, I'm going to leave, I'm going to shuffle these over. I should just be able to move the whole thing like that. There we go. Now I can get those to align with the path. Like that. Okay, I'm going to bring them back a little bit. Right. Now I'm going to demolish those buildings. I'm going to go back to this one. I'm going to edit this particular building. Ugh, now it's going to want to join to that bit of the path, and I don't want it to do that. Uh, annoying, 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 annoying. Oh, no. Don't! It's all going wrong! It's probably a little deep. Okay, anyway, so... Let's see if I can figure this out. Alright, so we're going back to edit. Alright, so... What I can do here 
Because that's too far back. I don't like that. You know, it's gonna... It's... it's yeah. No. What I can do... Is drop that down to hack the path. Then delete the food shop. And then remake the food shop. Exactly where I want to put it. So I want a slight offset to allow for the walls. Like that. So now I should be able to go back to this one. Hit edit. A filter would be nice here, guys. And drop a wall down. Not great, but I can put a twist in it there. On one side, do the same on the other. Okay, well, eh, this one needs to move. Like that. Alright, see, that's not so bad. So now we got our little restaurant ever so slightly offset. Now we've got to do the same on the other side. But I think what I want to do is offset them so these the uh, queues don't run into each other. What was that? Now it's a burger, right? So I want a premium drinky shoppy. Now this one's actually in the right spot on this side. But I think what I'm going to do is continue on with my... Well, crap. Ah, oh, no! Luckily, we can do that. Oops. Alright, so. Now I want to do the same thing again. I'm going to edit. I'm going to put my shop down. Now I'm going to delete it. Hopefully. There we go. Now I can delete it. Done. Now it's made that nice little cut in the path for me so I can line my shop up on it. Just line it up as best as I can. Make sure it's close enough so the walls intersect. Actually, the other one's slightly further back, isn't it? Yeah, so the other one's back here a little bit more. Okay. Now I can select this building again. Hit edit. And now I can build my wall out to this one too. So now we have a nice double wide path with our archway and we have our uh, buildings, we have our shops rather, exactly where we want them lined up properly so that we can build around them inside this grid. Sneaky, huh? So I think what we're going to do is continue to... Whoa! Hello. This is trying to be clever. See that? Ooh. Yeah, we don't want clever. We want you to do what you're told. Oh, dang it. So now we can build out our nice little uh, grotto. Actually, I don't want to put that there. I want to put the restroom right here. So, we're going to have the same issue that we had before. It's not going to line up properly, so we are going to build it. And delete it. Then deselect our building. 
rotate him again. This I know this is a real pain in the neck, but it seems to be the only way to get it done at the moment. So we are going to get this lined up. Actually, we could probably put a little bit of a recess on it. So I make sure that I get this figured out properly. Okay. All right. Well, I am going to continue flushing this out. Uh, I'll add some platforms, I'll put some cannons and stuff sticking out the windows, we'll, we'll have our... Well, you know what, before we do that, let's edit the building, decorations, attachments, oh, they're under, oh, they're under scenery, aren't they? You, sir, are facing the wrong way. So we'll put one there. And we'll put one there. There we are. A, little red a couple of little red coats guarding the fort. I think putting them outside the restroom might be a bit much. I don't want to frighten the guests off. Well, what's next? So Alright, so after some plan around and some experiments and whatnot, I finally got my little castle fort thing finished ish for the most part. Eh, you know, it could do with a couple more details, but I'm not too worried about it. Um, you know, I put the castellations all the way around, I put these little towers up, I added this nice, kind of cool looking watchtower. I got the old Union Jack up there. What well, looks kind of wrong for the time period. Um, I threw the animated dudes in, uh, changed out the flooring, and I, I decided to connect up the backside to the to the pathway as well. And the bod seemed to be using it pretty well, so yeah, it, it seemed like a good idea at the time. Still getting a lot of um, a lot of crowding. Uh, if this is an indication of what we can. <laughs> what we can uh, expect to see when the game is actually released I'm gonna have to really whoops I'm gonna have to really revise how I uh, ooh, render error and the hat shop now you see it now you don't now you see it now you don't ooh, freaky yeah may have to revise how I have this set up um, make the actually recess them from the pathway or make the pathway a lot wider or something or other because I think that's going to potentially cause problems but I did a little more theming around it um, obviously because I moved stuff around I changed out some of the, some of the scenery around this side too and I realized I had this guy firing at the crowd as they're walking by so I moved him 
Um, and I did a couple of other minor changes around the park as well. Um, smoothed this out, changed its color. Now it's a bit more of a clue as to what, what p potential ride this is modeled on. Um, finished off the theming around this one. Uh, added in some more trees, some more lights and uh, added in the, the shipwreck and the little pirate cave and all the rest of it. I think it's all coming together pretty well. I think I'm going to call that it for the moment. I think that's a lot of the new material that I've exhausted in this particular section here. Well, and that one. I kind of goofed up and used a lot of the new stuff over here and I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to do it all over here, but eh, whatever. Take a look at this. Shut up, Cortana. Um, so I think that's going to be it. I'm going to continue playing around with this. I'll you know flush things out over here. Um, but um, I think for this quarter, I could probably squeeze another roller coaster in here. Actually, I've got plenty of room. <gasps> I might do that. Now, what kind of roller coaster would I put in there? What do you think? But, uh, yep, updates, uh, the next two updates here and here, I think. But, uh, she, it, it certainly looks pretty impressive from the, uh, from the entrance. Hang on, let's see if I can get down into the, into the entrance way here. What the heck's the captain doing away out of here? What are you doing out here, buddy? Get back in the park. You going home or something? Where's he going? Oh, he's going out to the car park to annoy the guests. He's following him. He's a stalker. He's stalking the people on their way home. But uh, yeah, it looks, it looks pretty impressive. The little the dive coaster visible here. Definitely need a bigger coaster, I think. Maybe one that comes flying across here, just to scare everyone. Anyway. I think I'm going to call that it for now. I will see you anon.